Yeah, it was nice. I always wanted to see it. Last year also was the same plan, but I didn't get to, to do it. Didn't have time. It was good. It was a lot of fun. I wanted to, to do it for a while. Good. It's better. Um, I, I had a bit of trouble um, at the end of, uh, in the middle of 2009, and I uh, worked a lot um, at the end of the year. Um, to get my health in order and, and physically, you know, to, to be in shape and do the right things. And um, it's good. I had a good um, season ending. I played well. Did a good off season. So I feel like I'm ready. Yeah, I was out for three months uh, around June. Um, so I had to work very hard when I came back, and it was not easy because I was really my health, uh, you know, was, was not was not good. I didn't do anything at all for three months, so I really had to do a lot of work. But, um, you know, I did the work and, and uh, US Open was not easy for me. Uh, it was my first tournament in, in you know, four months and the Grand Slam, so it was not easy to play there. But I needed to do it. I needed to get, um, you know, that match no matter what happens. And uh, end of the year was good. I did, we did a lot of work physically and, and I did a lot of work uh, on the court. Um, had a lot of matches, won a lot of matches, so I feel like, um, you know, I'm on the right track. Healthy. I would like to play the full year um, without any you know, health problems, without any injuries at all. Um, and I think if I can do that and if I can be consistent in the first few months of the year and do well, um, I think I can have a good year. You know, I've finished 55 in the world with, you know, playing um, half the schedule. So I think, you know, if I play well this year, um, the goal is to be in the top 20. Any underlying fees land that the chronic fatigue might come back if the push breaks out of it? Swing, you can't think about too much. Just keep that there yeah, I, th I need to, you know, control what I do. Obviously, I don't want to go out there and train 15 hours a day, and it's not something I do anyway. I, I try to focus on quality, so that's what we're working on. And I tr everything I do, I try to have it planned, and try to have a, a purpose for doing it, whether it's fitness or tennis. And, um, you know, I will try to do as much as I can with my schedule to have some time off when I can. Yeah, it's the first tournament of the year. It's the first few matches for everybody. Um, and it will be interesting to see how everybody is playing and what kind of shape they're in. But um, it will be good. I have two, two events leading up to the Australian Open. I'm in main draw of both of them. And, um, you know, again, you can draw anybody here also. It's a tough field. And... Um, with some players coming back, but um, you know, I would like to I would like to play well in my first match, see yeah, how I can do, and maybe get a get a win in the first one. I do actually. I yeah. feel like I'm hitting the ball well. Um, I feel like the biggest improvement has been my fitness. I think I'm moving very well, um, and my endurance is really really good. So I feel like I'm in much better shape than I was last year. And uh, like I said, hopefully if I don't get injured and my health is good, I can have a good year. I've been working on a few things. Um, you know, the more matches that I got in at the end of the year, the more we were trying to work on things. I was um, trying to put a lot more uh, mix in my game and, and trying to uh, come in a little bit more. Worked a lot on my serve and I worked uh, really, really hard on my movements. So um, those would be a couple of things that I would try to do straight away in the first few weeks of the year. And, um, you know, hopefully they will work out.